When we first met and began to have conversations about your desire, not just to have a marriage, but to have the very best marriage, my heart came alive as well. Because when you invest that kind of energy and that uh, purpose into your marriage, you guys are gonna have a marriage that others will envy. Brittany, God only knows how long I prayed for you to come into my life. I'm sorry, this is gonna be long. <laughs> I've been searching my whole life for you. I'll never forget the moment that I first realized I loved you. We were driving back from Somerset after I had met your parents for the first time. We had driven separate, so I followed you in my car. And the entire drive back, I was consumed with fear that something bad would happen to you. And all I wanted to do was protect you. And in that moment, I realized that I cared about you more than I cared about myself. And that feeling has never left me. Never knowing where it lead me to. Alec, I am so thankful that you had the courage to ask me out on our first brunch, even if it was just as friends at first. After that brunch, we were together always. I may have been uncertain on that very first brunch, but today and every day after that, Something that I know that I am certain about is my love for you. After four years of slogging through college, one weekend he came back and the beaten down college student attitude that I knew so well had changed a little bit. And that's when I heard about Brittany. Didn't take long for Brittany and Alex's visits to become the highlight of our months in the household and didn't take much longer for me to realize they're meant for each other. I charge you both as you stand here today in God's presence to remember that love and honor alone will stand as a foundation of a happy and an enduring home. I love you because being with you has taught me more about love and what it means to love than any class or book ever could. I love you because you motivate me to be the best version of myself that I can possibly be. She easily became part of our family. Crying yet? <laughs> After helping him smuggle an engagement ring out of St. Martin, <laughs> I was under the impression it wouldn't take that long for him to propose. I was completely wrong. <laughs> we patiently waited for the day Alec would propose, and more than a year went by, and on one occasion, back home, Dad brought Alec downstairs, unlocked the safe, gave him the ring, and told him, this shouldn't be in here. And Alec looked at him and asked, where am I gonna put it where she's not gonna find it? And dad said, on her finger. <laughs> when I was trying to think of a good story to tell, I opened my phone for some inspiration and I realized that you're still on my phone as Brittany, AKA my sister wife. <laughs> and I was pretty much your personal relationship coach. But that pretty much ended once you met Alex, so I take that as a good sign that he's the one. <laughs> you are the most genuine and most down-to-earth person I know. You are incredibly smart. You always know how to make me laugh, even when I'm having a bad day. And you make me want to be a better version of myself every single day. I love you because you're smart, beautiful, and one of the kindest people I've ever known.
I love you because you motivate me to be the best version of myself that I can possibly be. And most importantly, I love you because you bring me closer to God. I would say that today I give you my heart, but you've had that for a while now. I can't wait to grow old together. Looking back at the beautiful life that God has blessed us with, especially knowing that I have gotten to spend this life with the person I love most. Maybe two months go by, I'm at work, cubicle life, and I, I got two text messages. The first is from Alec, reading, Brittany and I are engaged, nothing else. <laughs> And the other one is from uh, our sister Kylie that says, Mom is having a breakdown in this thrift store. You're two of the most selfless, generous people I've ever met. And your love for Jesus sets an amazing and inspiring example for others. I wish you many years of life together, love, and happiness. My favorite marriage philosopher is Billy Crystal, who said, when you realize you want to spend the rest of your life with someone, you want the rest of your life to begin as quickly as possible. So with the power vested in me by the state of Kentucky and as a minister of the Lord Jesus Christ, I now pronounce you husband and wife. What God has joined together, let no man put asunder. Alec, you may kiss your bride. To Brittany and Alec. To Brittany and Alec, a lifetime of love and happiness. God bless you both.